Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Oh my gosh, this is so nice. One thing about this house though, the lights in this house. Okay, let me calm down. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I'm Swatlim Kize and this is my channel. If you are a regular digula, a regular liker, a regular sharer, honey. Thank you so much for coming back once again, baby. And if you are new here today, welcome to the channel. Make sure that you click that subscribe button so you can join the regular degulars. Guys, number one, please excuse my yellow braces. Oh my gosh, I need to do a disclaimer. I had this Thai curry the other day and then I just went like two minutes, first bite, my whole power chain, all the elastics in my mouth turned yellow. So I've accepted it. This is going to be the situation until I go back to Beijing. So yeah, just letting you know. Anyway, I'm in the new apartment. I've moved in. Today was the moving day. It's a Saturday. I'm exhausted. Um, but I'm so grateful for the moving guy, guys. He was so helpful. Anyway, so I am just like settling in and I realized they didn't clean the house. So I'm a little frustrated, but what I'm going to do is take away all the stuff they left. Let me show you guys. They left all these stuffed toys. And as well, she left because I'm as camping welcome gift. Lord knows. And then there's all of that stuff there um, that I want to like clean up. Let me guys. Let me show you guys the bath, the kitchen. I'm a bored. And as well, she left because I said, but please look how dirty this microwave is. I almost died. Oh, the horror. So I actually need to take um. All the stuff and put it in like a, a box, one of the boxes. And then Sasa, I have work. Ne, look at this, guys. Yo, not sure. So like Sasa. I was saying, tomorrow I have work, so I actually can't do much right now. I think I need to rest, otherwise I'm gonna be extremely cranky tomorrow, and I need to be, you know, my normal self. So um, work starts at eight tomorrow. We're actually preparing for the kids because they start school <clears throat> after this long holiday they had. Um, on Monday, so I'm just gonna do like the cleaning up of the stuffed toys and just the lamapo do it and then um, I'm gonna get some rest. I'm actually gonna make my bed and I'm gonna sleep But I'm gonna do um, a weekly vlog out of this video So this is the start of a weekly vlog. You guys are gonna see how I unpack and get settled in um, I wanted to do a moving vlog, but actually guys it was a lot on me I wasn't sleeping well this week. I haven't been sleeping well this week rather um, just nerves and just like you know just it's been a lot it's been a lot moving is a lot and I'm just grateful to God guys he ordered all the steps in front of me literally I had no problems um, just any like logistical problems nothing like that I had enough money to do everything I didn't have to you know um, delay things everything just worked perfectly so I'm really grateful for that um, and yeah so I just wanted to start this weekly vlog and then it's gonna just be all of what I'm doing this week. I don't think I'll take you guys to my new school as yet. Obviously, we need to get settled. We need to get, you know, um, um, equipped, not equipped. What's the word? We need to get used to the environment, okay? They need to be like, you know. Okay, let's see, so we have look. Okay, we'll let's enjoy it. <laughs> anyway, I'm so happy to be here. It feels good to be here, actually. I was nervous about how it feel, but it feels good to be here. So yeah, guys, don't forget to click that subscribe button, honey. We're on the road to 3K, okay? That's all pretty on <laughs> Okay, guys, uh, I've just um, cleaned and scrubbed down this kitchen counter. It was giving me so much anxiety. The walls were disgusting. So I just decided I'm going to do that. And I did the toilet as well. And I made sure that the sink is also very scrubbed down because... I'm hungry and I can't even warm food because I get anxiety about this filthy kitchen. But yeah, now it smells good. And let me tell you, this girl, oh, you can come this. Oh, gosh. This girl, she is the girl she thinks she is, okay? Flipping amazing. It reminds me so much of Handy Andy. It's so good. Everything is shining because of her. Anyway, I'm going to go to. Uh, bed now guys I'm gonna eat and then go to bed I'm gonna put my microwave here and then yeah go to bed anyway all right guys let's catch up tomorrow hey guys <laughs> so I'm actually sitting here it's a Wednesday today. I haven't touched the camera since Sunday night. No, since Saturday. That day I arrived here. 
um i'm gonna do better so this is um just an update how about how this week has been um it's been so overwhelming at the same time but it's also been very like it's been like i feel like i'm here for a reason i feel like um everything is happening for a reason i feel settled a little bit more now um i haven't cleaned as much as i would like to clean because honestly my days start at um 7 50 a.m i leave work at 4 50 and then i'm exhausted come home eat sleep repeats you know and i'm breaking out badly let's penguin but this Saturday or this weekend, I'm actually going to do a little bit of self-care in addition to cleaning. I'm going to get my hair done on Sunday. I'm going to do my nails on Saturday and I'm going to clean this house on Saturday. So those three things are, are going to be in this vlog for the rest of this vlog. So I just wanted to catch up with you guys. And just to say, yeah, no, live lucky is a jump on my days. Le, it's going to be one I've never done before where I'm like skipping days. But guys this is not easy actually and uprooting your life from another city um is a lot and honestly the city is not you know a, a tier one city it's like definitely a tier three so it's way smaller things are not as you know western as the bigger cities so i'm gonna get used to that the good thing is the, there's a really good city nearby called changzo that i'm gonna go to and do my hair and it's like an hour away with the with the bus so that's a little bit more um second tier close to first tier i guess so yeah <sighs> But yeah, I'm feeling a little bit more like myself. Let me get up. I'm feeling a little bit more like myself. Um, yeah, I just wanted to check in and just say, guys, I'm here. This vlog is going to continue properly on Saturday. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to get some rest and we will catch up on Saturday. One of a kind, one of the better boys I'm on your level, that's what you say But all I hear is noise I don't have time for Trying my luck, I've been too hurt before You're not that special, just give it up I think I've had enough I'm too busy loving my friends I ain't got no love to spare for you I'ma be that girl to the end It don't really matter you do guess i have to tell you again because you haven't got the news all you really need to want is Hey guys, so today is a Sunday morning. Um, it's the day after uh, doing my hair. And so I just wanted to sit down and just chat with you guys. I have my little cup of coffee here. Um, just to recap, so this week has been my first week in Liang. Yane. 
<laughs> it's completely different. But first, let me before I start, I just want to say thank you guys so much for giving me the time to rest um, and you know to take a little bit of uh, time to just get settled in. None of you actually like you know were on me about a video after I told you guys on Instagram that guys this week is going to be hectic. I'm not putting a video up. You guys are super patient, so thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Um, I think this has been a very productive week for me. Um, I know sometimes we think productive means, you know, ticking off boxes of, you know, doing things, uh, getting things achieved, or, you know, uh, reaching your goals, which is great. But I think also uh, being productive is resting and putting yourself first and prioritizing self-care so that is what i did this week i prioritized doing my hair every time i do my hair guys my confidence levels just go on 2000 you know like it just moves up it just like gets me moving it's a great way to start the week you know so um that happened so yeah let me just do a recap so you guys i'm sure saw a bunch of videos before this actual clip that i'm doing now um so yeah the school itself has been amazing everyone's super kind it's very different very different very different from a training center i think it's more like prevalent when you're talking about um just dealing with english training obviously in training centers that is their primary goal to sell the product your booty your child is coming to learn english but actually in kindergartens it's just about kids being in a safe space where um the parent knows that they've left the child where it's safe it's clean they can eat they can rest and that's about it you know the english element is just me being around there and using my um obviously native tongue in saying come here sit down come with me let's go. so they are learning they're getting exposed to english and then i only have like 40 minutes a day to actually teach them English, which is great. My kids are amazing. They're such cutie pies. I'm gonna insert some pictures here um, of the ones that I got some snaps of, but they love just to climb on me. It's so cute. Um, my apartment is coming along well. I'm gonna start decorating, just getting a few pieces. I'm gonna start putting up my paintings and my photographs on the wall. So I'll give you guys a tour, um, I will say next month. Also, um, just living here in this city has been, such a humbling experience i think i spoke to um last night i was with a bunch of other africans while i was doing my hair and I, we were talking about um for some like talking about if i was to come to liang for the first time coming to china all right so let's say uh when i first came here in 2019 i arrived and the first city i worked in was uliang liang let me tell you, I feel like this wouldn't have been a good start for me. I think I would have, it would have been really challenging. Mainly because one, it's a small city. Two, there aren't a lot of foreigners. Three, um, it's just so, like, it's developing, okay? And so coming from a situation where you want a space where you can get accustomed and you can really build a life for you, for yourself, and, you know, get around and do things and not have to struggle. For me, being here for four years and coming to a small city, I can get a hold of things that I can I can find in a big city or a tier one city whilst being here. Like I know my Taobao stores, I know my WeChat contacts, I know my my places, you know? I know where to get my skincare stuff. Whether I am in Umgodi somewhere, I'm a farmer, I would still be able to get my things. And that for me has been such an amazing lesson that Swa, you are extremely like able you are able to find the things that you need with that whatever situation you're in you are proactive you know where to find your things you know and so that is me that is what i've learned about this week but yeah it's been a wonderful week we're back now we're, we're full in the swing we are we are full in the swing wow Excuse. we are in full swing with our content creation now i'm settled i'm gonna start exploring the city i'm gonna plan a little getaway on my weekend because now guys our weekends are saturday and sunday it's no more monday tuesday so coffee you know how much i love coffee okay um so yeah we're gonna do a lot of getaways i'm gonna go do my nails right now guys gooby 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 my nails broke while moving boxes honeys so I'm going to just uh, do like a simple French mini uh, manicure. I think it's a mini. Wow. Just a little French um, manicure. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to end this video off nicely. I'm going to start a weekly vlog tomorrow. 
and i'm gonna catch up with you guys later on this week thank you so much for watching don't forget to click that subscribe button honey we are on the road to 3,000 subscribers <laughs> Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next video. Mwah. <laughs>